Welcome back to Tenorshare everyone. My iPhone 8 has come a long way with me. It's becoming slower than before, so I wonder is there a way to make it faster during daily use? Then I find out a hard reset can do that. So today I'm gonna show you guys how to hard reset your iPhone 8. Before we start to hard reset, you should know. Hard reset in another word is force restart. So if what you want is to reset your iPhone to factory default, that's factory reset. But don't worry, I will show you how to factory reset iPhone 8 too. Let's go. Hard reset iPhone 8. Press the volume up and quickly press volume down button. Then press and hold the power button. Keep pressing until the Apple logo appears. Then you had completed the hard reset. It's very simple. A hard reset can offload the cache that is stored on iPhone, and it could make your iPhone faster. Next, I will show you how to factory reset iPhone 8. Factory reset iPhone with Tenorshare Reiboot. This is an iOS device repair tool. It can fix more than 150 iOS issues and also have factory reset feature. Check out the download link in the description and download it. Once installed, connect your iPhone 8 to a PC or Mac and open Reiboot. Click the reset device option here. Choose the factory reset option. Here required download firmware and factory reset your iPhone 8. Click it. The download will not be long, depending on your network condition. Once the download is OK, click the Start Reset option. Reiboot will start to factory reset your iPhone 8. It will take a while. Relax and be patient, it will be done very soon. Then it is done. You can see my iPhone 8 is already factory reset completely. It's very easy and efficient. My iPhone 8 now is good as a new one. Go try it yourself. Third, factory reset iPhone 8 in the settings. Go to the settings page, tap general, and scroll down to tap the transfer or reset iPhone option. Here choose erase all content and settings, continue, enter your password, tap erase iPhone. Wait for the process over, then your iPhone 8 has completed the factory reset. All your data will be gone after the factory reset. If you prefer to use iTunes or Finder, I also will show you how to do it with iTunes or Finder. Fourth, factory reset iPhone 8 with iTunes or Finder. Connect your iPhone 8 to a PC or Mac because iTunes and Finder basically are the same. So here I will use iTunes to factory reset your iPhone 8. Here we'll need an extra step. Put your iPhone 8 in recovery mode. So press the volume up and volume down button, then press and hold the power button. Keep pressing till the recovery mode screen shows up. Then you will see iTunes pop up a window. Here choose restore option. Then iTunes will begin to download the firmware. When the firmware is done, it will start restoring your iPhone 8. But sometimes iTunes or Finder will occur errors. It's annoying. The download and restores process is also very long so I will skip them. So I still recommend you try Reiboot. Okay, that's it. I hope this video is helpful to you. I'll be grateful if you subscribe. See you guys next time.